All right, here we are, snowball event. For some reason, the event isn't live, but the packs are, so I don't know. We got them. UB likes their money, so here we go. Let's uh, let's pop these open. I'm sure the event's gonna be live in the next couple hours, but for now, let's uh, let's see what this uh, has to offer. Okay, can't go fast apparently. Got snowballs flying across my screen. We got the OSA uniform, kind of clean. It's not bad. You always have tattoos there? Or are those new? I don't actually remember her model. But anyway, that was advanced. Got the, the Rudolph skin. The Reindeer Games. I think Rudolph, was Rudolph a uh, gun skin before? I think so. So, I don't know. Anyway, the white attachment skin that's finally in the game. I'm going to equip this to a lot of guns. I mean, it's not like plain white. It's like got a snowy effect to it. I still want like a cream white skin, but... You know what, we'll take that for now, we'll take that for now. And we got the... The Blackbeard Santa. You know, could have bought that last Christmas and would have saved me some money here, but... Here we are. Got Osa's headgear. Alright, not bad. We got the... Thorn. All ears. Uh... I, I don't even know what to say to that. That's, that's interesting. Green eyes. You know, is what it is. The gun skin to go with the Christmas ash we got last Christmas? I think it was. Did we get the ash skin last Christmas and the Monty one before that? I think so. Yo! Player cards. That's cool. I actually had no idea player cards were in these. That's cool. I'll take that. This is the skin. That I saw leaked, and it is sick. We're gonna hit that equip button right there, because that is clean. That is so sick. I love that skin. Next, got Blackbeard Santa Claus player card. And the Osa player card. And now we get the Yeti MP5. The, I'm assuming that's what he, it's a Yeti or Abominable Snowman or something like that. Not bad. Looks a lot like the, um... Reminds, gives me like the, uh, Norango skin vibe. The Blackbeard gun skin. We got the... Rook uniform. Not bad. That's kind of clean. I don't mind that. Cool. Got Bucks player card. That's cool. I like that. I think I'm going to equip that one for sure. And Vigils. Ooh. You know, I just got a Legendary in my last pack opening for Vigil, like that Molten Lava one. But I think this one's cooler. I'm going to equip that one for sure. That's clean. I could have hit the equip. I keep forgetting to equip buttons there. Frost Uniform. Not bad, not bad, not bad. Castle uniform. Kinda just looks like the Pro League castle, but like some blue and yellow. And Castle's gun skin. Meh. This one kinda looks crushed. Why are the bears on different gun? I don't know. Anyway. That one's meh. Won't be using that one probably, unfortunately. Oh, the universal skin. Looks like the old, old, like, skin way back, like, 2015 Christmas or something. But it's not, unfortunately. Brick player card. We got the... Vigil headgear. I can't wait until I quit comp. I can use all these fun skins. Because they're kind of cool. I can't use them in competitive, unfortunately. We got Swan. Swan charm that I'll probably never use. Aww. Low key, kind of underwhelming. Like, it's not terrible. It's got a racer vibe to it, like the SES racer vibe. I don't know. The uniform's a lot cooler than the gun skin for Buck, for sure. There's the headgear for Buck. Not bad. And. 
the Thorn player card. We also got the Thorn uniform. Yeah, what is going on with her face, man? That looks weird. I don't know how I feel about that. Her face looked weird. A reindeer charm. And Blackbeard's uniform. You now, some old reused skins and packs. Good times. Frost. I don't mind that player card. The player card's pretty clean. Pretty clean. Legendary. Oh, the universal player card. On shall I? That's kind of cool. I don't mind that. I'm glad they add player cards to this, like the game in general. This is sick. Bro, they went all out on Vigil. And I think it's awesome. Vigil probably has the best uh, best uniform in here for sure. Auntie Shield. Vigil's got the best uniform. Uh, Zero's got the, or not Zero. Uh, Thorn's got the best gun skin. You know, Rook's uniform is not bad, also. I like Rook's. They probably get second. Best player card was probably Bucks. And the Swan is the best charm. We'll give a number one Swan charm. Or char Ooh. That's kind of clean. I like that, for sure. Put that one. Remember to use that equip button. I'll go back and get all the other stuff equipped. But I mean, who did I say had the best uniform? I already forget. Rook. I think I said Rook. But Castle. Definitely up there with that headgear. Buck. Nutcracker. And Monty's player card. And our last pack, I don't remember what it is. Vigil's player card. Plain, not bad. I'm gonna have a few, oh, never mind. So if you're wondering, uh, there's a few that I didn't get because I already owned them previously. Got the Monty headgear that I didn't get because I uh, got it from the Christmas. The Ash headgear, it wants to load. Loading issues, there it is. The Ash headgear. I'm going to go down to uniforms, the Ash uniform, and the Monty uniform. All together, 45 items. That's all of them. Not bad. Um, definitely one of the better sets, in my opinion, for sure. I think they did a very good job on some of these. Sucks they reused some, like the Blackbeard, Ash, and Monty. So if we exclude those, the four players, or the four operators, their gun skins... Headgears, uniforms, and the the seasonal skin uh, are pretty good. I enjoyed it. It was pretty good. And uh, yeah, so if you guys enjoyed, hit that like button. And I'll see you guys hopefully very soon. Take it easy. Peace.